get to the point. How you got here? What you mean, how I got here? Like, you hit up OG, OG hit you up, I'm confused. No, neither one. My friend did an interview with OG and mentioned me dating Lance. OG wanted to bring me to the group to talk about you, which I refused to do. So she wanted to start some with me. Who's was walking the door. It's like, woof. So I guess she just ready to let loose. Right, so I'm trying to figure out, like, what's T? Like, because I felt like when you t when you DM me, you was mm -hmm. trying to play on my top. Like, you sent me a very disrespectful DM. What you feel the DM was disrespectful? Let's pull it out. She sent me a video of someone sleeping with someone, which wasn't me. It was clearly either her or someone else. You know, I find it really weird that this chick Nia is here. It's like, girl, you're just hanging out with people that hang out with me. A lot of is not adding up. We're not gonna play on my top today. What is your top? You're not gonna play with me. What's your top? <laughs> if you don't understand it, we're gonna Who get to play with. So What's you the sent play me about? a video. What's the play about? Yeah, uh, I did. Uh, some weird activity. Are we really talking about this? A whole sex tape right now? Wait, what happened? This is what she sent me. So I'm like, this is weird. That's what you sent me. Yeah, that's what Accident he sent me. Accident if it was me. I mean, he sent it and said it was. He said he was with He's, me. Yeah. So I said, well, I'm gonna ask her then. I'm gonna see. I'm not gonna lie. I did a lot of messy ass in that relationship, like high school ass messy. That's not my man. Like I'm, I'm, I'm really lost right now. Okay, I don't know what else you want me to dig up and scoop up and give you. At the end of the day, yes, that was a petty moment. And of course I hit you up because me and him was having a petty moment. You know the mess that he does. And I'm pretty sure when you dated him, he made you be in positions where you wowed out. Yeah. Lance is my hey. pants. I'm not with Lance anymore. Not that is for me, so Thank the Lord. Okay, then. There's always chaos in that situation with anybody. And that's why I got the f about that situation. That's the best thing you could have did. I'm just glad I got out of it. So you don't talk to him no more? No, like... I do not speak to him at all. Okay. I don't I don't want... I, I'm good. I'm, I mean, you answered the questions. You know, I couldn't admit that during quarantine, I done built up a lot of stress that I would have rather taken out on this chick, but it seems like today, she don't want no issues. So I'm gonna be nice for now. I thought we was doing a reggae party. I know, right? A reggae party? Well, I figured we would all come over together and have some fun and do a reggae fest. I've been trying to do this since we came on this vacation. All of that. Don't trust Jackie. Why? Phoebe. You got these girls thinking you they friends and Oh, girl. are you they friends? Jackie, is, speak for Jackie is not your speak friend. Speak for yourself. This y'all situation. See? Flap it, now, please. come on, I'm next, and you already know. You've been, oh. waiting, you've been waiting to get me. Go ahead. Last I saw you, I thought we had a fun exchange. I don't know if it was genuine. I'm not sure. Yeah, I mean, I thought it was, but at the same time, Phoebe, I don't know. I mean, how no, you feel? I thought it was genuine when we met. And yeah, then I thought it was, too. You tricked me. It's a like right now. Go ahead, keep going, go, go ahead. I felt like me and you started off on a rocky start, but like I said, I'm not tripping that, Phoebe. I'm not. Like, mm -hmm. if you're tripping, you already know we can, we can do whatever, but I don't have a problem with you, straight up. All right. Maybe we're getting somewhere, I don't know. Got one eye open, But though. you ain't gonna change. You a feisty it. little something, and you, 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 you something. You know, I just have this weird love-hate relationship with Jackie. But if this is ever going to be a sisterhood, maybe some of the problems have to get eliminated. I'm keep my eye on you. <laughs> Look at that. Well, I got <laughs> on you too. I'm glad we see each other. I'm going to keep my little eye on you, Phoebe. I think that we all are in the same group. We all are going to be around each other. We might as well put out on the table. We like ready. the fact that you and somebody you've been friends with forever, you know how I feel about that, Jen? You know how I feel about that, Evelyn? I told both of you, you've never said anything negative about her to me, other than you've always had nothing but love for her and vice versa. The other day, she said, I would never go over there. And look, she came over tonight, and that was good. You know, I want good for your life. I don't wish you nothing bad. I want the same for Evelyn. I only wish her good things, and I'm happy that we can be in the same room together. Who knows, maybe in the future, we can hang out more. Yeah, I don't even wish OG nothing bad. I don't. People are gonna say and do what they want, and I can't control that. But it just, situation is what it is, Jackie. Yeah. 
Hearing that Evelyn has no ill will towards OG, it gives me a glimmer of hope for this group. We made a lot of progress tonight. Phoebe and Nia put their differences aside, and me and Phoebe are actually gonna be moving forward. And even Jen is taking baby steps to make her way back into the fold with the rest of the ladies. And that is a lot of growth for this group. Well, I'm glad y'all talked. Thanks, guys. Thank Bye. you, ladies, for having of us. Of course. Bye. Bye, Bye Mama Cita. Give me my hug. Yeah, we, we, we broke the ice. I feel so hopeful about the group. Malaysia and Jackie made up. Phoebe and Jackie seem like they're OK. I sat in a room with Jennifer. Lord knows we have gone through so much the last year, but I think that um, I see good things happening in the future. Hi, it's Evelyn Lozada from Basketball Wives. Subscribe to VH1's YouTube channel so you don't miss anything this season.